practice it self check 8.17 what is a constructor so what is a constructor well constructor is if we look back actually at a previous problem we did um, with our 8.16 point client we have this public class point client constructors are used inside of classes right so when we initially make an instance of our object we can choose to pass something in or not pass something in we have a default constructor that has nothing passed in and it automatically you know sets a location right set location to zero zero um, or we can have something passed in and that will set these variables now the constructor name has to be the same name as the class name it's basically the same thing it has to be public also just not including the word class so let's go back to our current one. What is a constructor? Let's look at the following. We want to check all that apply. A constructor is a special method that creates an object and initializes its state. This is gonna be true because it is a, it's a special method. It's the first one that's called and it creates an object and it kind of declares, it sets the variables. A class can have many methods, but only one constructor. This is false. We just saw from the previous one, it has two constructors. A constructor can be used instead of fields to represent the data inside of a class. This unfortunately is false. Constructor cannot be used over fields to represent data. The constructor is just used to assign the fields themselves. A constructor is declared without a return type. This is true. We're not returning anything, just setting. Constructors are considered bad programming style and should be avoided. This is entirely opposite. You should use them. A constructor is the code that is called when the when you use the new keyword. This is true. Remember, it's the default method that's called with the class. And this last one is just a bit silly. So those are the three that we are looking with in passing one other one tests. So that is it for that.